back. Be very lucky. They're back. That's like the old days. Oh, it's fantastic. Nice to see a bit of colour. Many thanks. Uh, Mrs H, so how are you doing? Are you good people? Fit and well, I hope. And um, of course, having good shaves. And we're halfway through the week. So stay in there. <laughs> Near in the weekend. Well, for me, you see, I love um, two things the weekend. I can have a drink. Uh, I love to cook Sunday. And I love to cook Saturday night. Something spicy and hot. Depends on what's uh, Mind you, that's getting very uh, rare with this uh, condition we're in in the, in the world at the minute. Uh, job to get out and find things. Because you can only go out, you know, when you need, when you need essentials, obviously. Anyway, shave. I came across a soap today. I thought, God, I loved using this. And I bought it in Leeds. GOF Trumper Spanish Leather. Now, someone did ask me what my favourite, I think they asked uh, Taylor's um, Geo Trumpers, Dia Harris. So it'd be the lime for Dia Harris. It'd be the grapefruit for Taylor's. And I'd have to say this for Geo Trumpers. Fantastic stuff. I got it in Leeds in a meetup and the shop's no longer there, but you can still buy online, I think. Um, I'll put it in the video description uh, razor very standard sort of entry level it's quite famous for uh, a lot of people's first razor uh, along with the edwin jagger d89 the merker 34c short handle non-adjustable uh, it's a two-piece razor twist the bottom oh and the persona red second use how do I know? Because uh, it's on the one dot on the dice. It's been used once. <sighs> Clever me, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Very slight overhang to be aware of. So, standard aggression there. Nothing major. Brush of choice. Yaki. Yaki Da. 24mm. Well, tuxedo synthetic knot. Uh, it's going to match. Um, where is it? It's over there, we need that. It's going to match my ball. <laughs> More or less. Um, I haven't done it for that, but... Uh... Okay, so we've loaded the brush. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is, and it's good, good cream. Never surprises me, things like this. When I like something a lot, they usually discontinue them. <laughs> I think it's still available, I'm just saying that's what we're using. Blob in the bottom. No need to soak the brush, so we'll just wet it. Well, I uh, wet this uh, face. Oh, lovely. No matter what happens, uh, always makes it better with a shave and a, a very British thing is anything goes pear-shaped as we call it, anything goes wrong no matter what it is even this virus, there's a virus going round never mind, let's put the kettle on, let's have a cup of tea <laughs> it always makes it better right, here we go so I've soaked it, it's wet, it's not dripping and straight away so how's your shaves this week been? alright? Uh, I know, Oof. oh come on, it's very, uh, to give you a, an idea of the scent, it's gorgeous scent, absolutely stunning, but what I can, I'm not sure if you can get Imperial Leather anywhere else, can you get it abroad, Cousins Imperial Leather soap, hand soap, we can get it here, for, for years it was a posh soap, hand soap years ago, if you had that, Oh, you've done some overtime. <laughs> it's a very similar scent to that. That if you like that, you'd love this. Beautiful scent. Look at that straight away. No messing. That's what we're after. There we go. So.
I finally at the moment sorted these uh, filming lights out new batteries now rechargeables fully charged it seems to be working better today for some reason or it looks better there I don't know if it is in real life so hopefully absolutely stunning oh the scent I can't get over it as soon as I smelt it um, I'm not sure if someone recommended it in the meetup and said have you tried this and I said no and I smelt it you know it's one of them whether you need it or not I'm having it <laughs> right Let's heat the Merca 34C. And then give it a shake and off we go. First pass, Persona Red, second use. Mmm, nice. No messing. You see me, sorry. So we're having a... Because I know uh, a lot of people who love wet shaving and um, but they tend to, in the week, working week, have a uh, sort of a, a Mac 3, you know, car cartridge shave, just to be quick and be presentable as well. And that's fair enough, you know, especially that probably makes this type of shave um, more relaxing, more enjoyable, as was at the weekend or whatever. But uh, I also know that lots of people shave this way no matter what. And the thing is, Slick is beautiful, the scent is gorgeous. And I forgot you can smell it's one of those you can smell in the bathroom after it's beautiful. Yeah, um whatever works, isn't it? You know, whatever works for you is the best best way. Very slick. See with a touch of water. Mm. This is luxury for a midweek shave. <laughs> It can be a pain, as many of you will know by now, with having this uh, see it and have, you have to buy it. You don't need stuff, but you buy it. Some are very behaved, of course, but the majority of us, I think, do uh, indulge, should we say, in buying things. And I think uh, this is one of those soaps. <laughs> Creams, I should say, not a, it's a cream. Across the growth. Here we go. Very slick. Being aware of that overhang. See if I reopen any of these uh, 
dots I had last time. We could see. Well, they seem to like to show themselves. Thirty four C, one of those razors, like simple and yet very effective. It does exactly what it says. There's no bells and whistles. It just does the job. As you can most likely hear, good audio feedback. And uh, yesterday was a cracking day, sunshine. So, cream, okay, cream, sorry. Beautiful. Nice and clean. Very, very slick. I wish you could smell this. Unless you've tried it yourselves, you know what I mean. Leather. See, there's plenty. I'm just going to grab a bit more back to the water. Don't need to grab any more. There was enough in the brush, to be honest. Third application of lather. I was going to say before, as well, even though most of us have got plenty of soaps, creams, razors, brushes, uh, the more you have, people think, well, you're lucky. And, well, yeah, we are lucky. Very lucky. Um, but it can be a nightmare, especially if you're filming shaves, because you've got that much stuff and you think, well, I've used that, and, uh, what have I, and then you can't decide. Uh, get the violin out. <laughs> Against the growth. Here we go. Officially, that's the way for me. And it does get slicker. Have you had any barbecues last weekend, Easter weekend or this week? Do you plan on any? I know it's a big thing in the States, um, smoker, so you got a smoker, barbecue, huge things and pork butts, <laughs> all day smoking, with hickory is it, hickory wood, all day, I watch a fella called Shug, Shug Emery, and he's all day puts his pork butts in, they're smoking, they're cooking, and at the end he pulls them all to, you know, he, um, strips them. And they pull apart, and, oh god, it makes you want to go on a plane. <laughs> but 
but uh, my barbecue is a very inexpensive from Sainsbury's eight pounds little bucket and it's ideal because it's only me that eats the meat on it anyway if I do some uh, sort of vegetable kebabs that's fair enough Mrs H will have some of them but it's, um, usually it's just me unless I do sort of a vegetarian burger or something like that or sausages that's a nice way of cooking over coke coals wow this is gorgeous so uh, I tend to I may do another one as I say this week in the afternoon Maybe, uh, maybe tomorrow. You watch the weather will change now, I've said that. <laughs> but what I was going to say is the uh, the reason I get this inexpensive one is it's enough for me. It's proper coke coals. Uh, I know you can get gas and all bells and whistles and lad I work with in, well in work, he's got a rotisserie on his and it does a chicken. I mean, it's beautiful. But uh, if it's only me, and then you've got to store the damn thing. A lot of them, you leave them outside or they put a cover on them and they're there. But mine, once I finished, leave it overnight, empty the ashes, clean it out, back in the garage, out the way. So it does me for what I want, you know. But um, I haven't forgot, don't worry, just ahead of myself a bit. Three, two, one, pick up time, baby! Fourth pass, baby! And as you can hear, I'm very much needed fourth pass. That's, this is what we're doing, picking up. Pick ups, pick up time. Picking up the, the bits you've missed. You know, when you do that and you think, oh, there's a bit there. But I tend to overdo it. Uh, I don't just like whiskers off. I like the skin off as well. <laughs> into that. Just a bit there. Very gently. Good slickness, that is. Happy with that. So we'll have a cold water, cold water rinse. I don't care what anybody says, you don't get reactions like this with gels and cartridge reason. <laughs> Maybe for good reason. Ah, right. 
Then I thought lavender, we'll have a bit of lavender on today, there is. Right, and then we're going to use. Um, there's only one aftershave you could use really to match this scent, um, but it's not Cousins Imperial Leather. You could buy it here cheap years ago, then they stopped it. It's only available, I'm not sure if you can get it online, but in Australia it's still available. The new version of it, and it's gorgeous. But this is the original version. You can see this aftershave. And it does say somewhere. Uh, yeah. Cousins on the bottom. If it shows, if it's focused, it's blurred to me. But um, this is the original, what it looks like. And that's the bottle. There. You see that? I can't see it, but that's Imperial Leather. Oh. <laughs> Come on, baby. Three, two, one. Oh, come on, come on. You'd love it. Well, I used to wear it, I think, now and again. That's the original Imperial Leather, gorgeous. Um, and then a cream I've not used for a long time. Arco Classic, good stuff. This is mainly, really, uh, I've always um, used this in the winter as a good, it's a, you have to work it in. You don't need a lot of it, he says. It's good stuff. I've got this version, this is the classic, and I've also got the version with olive oil in it. That's nice. So you have to really rub it in. <laughs> yeah, so. Especially the neck area. It's a good thick cream. I'm rubbing it in. Brings blood to the face. Circulation. That's uh, So that's the end result. I say it many times. You're not better looking. But you'll feel it. Inside. So what have we used then quickly? I know you've got things to do. Um, Merca 34C. It's a two piece razor. Some say it's a three. As well if you stripped it down, but it's a two-piece officially razor. Um, Non-adjustable, it's a standard aggression. Um, Persona Red, second use, very nice. One of my favourite blades, or go-to blades anyway. Short handle, diamond knurling, does the job, fantastic. The Yaki 24mm Tuxedo Synthetic Knot with the clear red um, handle my bowl then we've used Welsh water to rinse Thayer's lavender with hazel Cousins in do you mind I'm in the middle, middle Cousins Imperial Leather aftershave and then the Arco classic moisture cream Absolutely beautiful. Really happy with that for a midweek shave. Really happy with that. Those are back, so that's another bonus. Bit of colour in the house. They'll go downstairs now. Probably uh, living room or conservatory. Conservatory? Conservatory. Hot house, glass house, summer house, whatever you call it. So thanks for watching. I hope you have fantastic shaves. Stay healthy and stay safe. And... Um, Look after yourselves and I'll see you Sunday for the weekend shave. Don't forget, check the description. I'll leave any links I can 
go to Facebook, Paul's Wetheads Facebook group, Mrs H is in charge of that and she'll welcome you to that if you want to have a look, if you want to join it, whatever, if you're not already and thank you to those that are for all your support throughout this YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, but I'm not so active on them, well Instagram at the minute because I need a new phone, but that's another story, another story, so uh, have a great rest of the week, stay safe and I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave. Take care.